Hey guys, thanks for stopping by iDub Hockey. My name is Tyson, and right now we're taking a quick look at the Bauer Vapor X40 hockey glove. Uh, it's a great looking glove from Bauer. Um, it really offers a great level of advanced protection, um, so it's going to be good for those intermediate to advanced level players. Um, it's definitely going to offer a great level of protection. Uh, now this is a Vapor glove, so it's going to have a tapered fit. Um, so we'll go over that a little bit later, but you can kind of see in the design of the glove that it's going to offer um, a snugger fit down here, but it's still open up to kind of give you a great in-between fit between a traditional and a contoured glove. Um, starting on the exterior of this guy, um, they've used a combination of materials. Uh, it's pretty similar to what you saw on the X60 glove, where you have right down the center of it, uh, this is a nice cable knit material. Uh, this is offer great durability as well as offering a little bit better breathability. Um, so it's going to help the glove dry a little bit better and it's also really light, so it gives the glove a nice light feel to it. Um, and then around the exterior of the glove, you can see here in this blue, um, going up to the cuff as well as around kind of the perimeter basically of the glove. Uh, this is a synthetic leather. Um, it's nice to see going in that portion because that is going to help uh, increase the overall durability of the glove. Um, so it's nice on the exteriors and some of those high wear areas to have that extended durability. Um, going on from there, uh, take a look at the protection they're using on this. Uh, like I said, this glove's offering an advanced level protection. So they're using dual density foams as well as plastic inserts. Um, so that's going to be through the fingers as well as in the back roll. Um, up in the upper cuff, you don't have the plastic inserts, but you do have some nice uh, dual density foams and some really high density foams on the outside to give you that advanced um, high level protection. Um, going on to the thumb, uh, this has a free flex thumb. So basically what it is, is it has a segment in here. So it's actually a two piece uh, free flex thumb. Um, that is going to be one of the differences between this glove and the X60. The X60 has the free flex lock thumb. So it's actually a three piece thumb and it goes all the way up. So that's, um, as you can see, has some good uh, range of motion for the thumb flex. Um, and then also similar feature up at the upper portion on the cuff, they have what I call the free flex cuff. And uh, basically how that works is it um, almost like two pieces here and you can see it's attached by a lycra like material. Um, so that's going to allow the cuff to move with the arm and giving you the protection but not hindering that range of motion. Um, so as you go ahead and put on the glove, you can really see as your you know, wrist might come down that this will stay closer to the wrist to keep that protection but not like I said not hindering any of the mobility of the glove. Um, so that's a nice feature to see on it. Now taking a look at the palm on this guy, you can see it has a similar design to the X60 where they're actually still using that Lycra base layer, so that's going to be the black material right here. Uh, and that's going to offer some great range of motion in the hand for finger movement as well as offering a nice comfortable feel to it. And then you have some more traditional leathers which are layered on top of that as you can see here with the lighter gray and the darker gray. So that's going to offer a more traditional feel as well as some good uh, durability out of the glove. Um, you can see they're also using that uh, double overlay on the thumb to help increase the lifespan of the glove. Um, and then also another nice thing about it is they're kind of using um, a Lycra-like uh, gussets on this. Um, so it really does have some great finger motion. This is a brand new glove and you can see it doesn't require much break-in. They have a triple segmented index finger so that helps also with the finger movement. Uh, going on from there, take a look at the inside liner. They're using the Thermomax Plus, so it has a nice soft feel to it as well as wicking away moisture. Uh, last year this was the top of the line liner. Um, this year they introduced a new liner, so um, it's a great liner seen on this glove. Um, and then as I go ahead and put on the glove to go over the overall fit of it, uh, like I mentioned in the beginning of this video, uh, this is a tapered fit glove meaning that's going to be a little bit snugger in the beginning portion of the glove and then opening up um, in the cuff. So it's going to offer that range of motion, but still have a slightly snugger fit than you might get out of a four roll design or a more traditional glove. So you can see how it kind of hugs into the hand. Um, so you have a snugger fit, making sure that the glove is going to move with your hand, but not, resi not um, restricting the movement that you can make on it. Uh, so once again, that's just been a quick look here at the Bauer Vapor X40 hockey glove here at Inline and Ice Warehouse.